ਸਤਿ ਸ੍ਰੀ ਅਕਾਲ ਬੇਟਾ ਜੀ ਲੈਟਸ ਡੂ ਵਨ ਪ੍ਰੋਬਲਮ ਨਾਓ ਵੀ ਨੋ ਦ ਸਨੈਲਸ ਫਾਰਮੂਲਾ ਐਂਡ ਵੀ ਕੈਨ ਅਪਲਾਈ ਟੂ ਐਨੀ ਥੀਟਾ ਬਟ ਕੈਨ ਵੀ ਅਪਲਾਈ ਸਨੈਲਸ ਫਾਰਮੂਲਾ ਟੂ ਐਨੀ ਐਂਗਲ ਲੈਟ ਅਸ ਚੈੱਕ ਦੈਟ ਸੋ ਫॉर ਟੁਡੇਜ਼ ਐਗਜ਼ਾਮਪਲ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਟੇਕਿੰਗ ਥਿਸ ਐਜ਼ ਅ ਰਿਫਰੈਕਟਿੰਗ ਸਰਫੇਸ ਬਿਲੋ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਗਲਾਸ ਅ ਮੀਡੀਅਮ ਵਿਚ ਇਜ਼ ਡੈਂਸਰ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਮਾਈ ਐਮ1 medium 1 and here is m2 which is air which is lighter refractive index is 1 uh, glass refractive index is 1.5 so i know that now what i'm doing is at this point of contact i'm making a incident ray to fall at 45 degree okay so theta i is equal to 45 degree now it will refract let's see so we will find the angle from the formula of snell's law so let's apply snell's law step by step so it says uh, v1 divided by sin theta i equal to v2 sin theta r let me draw a rough guess that it will reflect like this so this should be some theta r i don't know whether i'm right or not but i am just trying okay now oh, i can fill the values of v1 and v2 because i know the refractive index so let's do it the v1 will be c divided by what 1.5 because this is the medium of glass which has a refractive index of 1.5 so velocity of light will be c divided by 1.5 what will be the value of sin theta i it is around 0.7 i am taking rough value is equal to c because the second medium is air so it will be c by 1 or i can simply say c and sin theta r okay as of now we are okay so i'll take this this side and these values this side c and c will be cancelled so the next line i am getting is sin theta r will be equal to 1.5 into 0.7 what will be the value of this let me take a help of calculator 1.5 into 0.7 okay so the value is 1.05 now i am telling you here is a problem this value has a problem can you tell what is the problem okay if you don't get it what we can do we can take an inverse we can go further so theta r will be equal to sin inverse of 1.05 and when i put this in calculator sin inverse of 1.05 oh i am getting an error so there is something wrong my calculator is saying can you guess what is the wrong here what is the problem here but a sin has the maximum value of 1 which comes at sin 90 degree and here the sin theta value is coming as 1.05 beyond one it is not possible so i can say something here let's see numerically sanu ki mil raha hai numerically i can say that sin theta value ya yeah, refraction is not possible right 1.05 sin theta cannot be 1.05 it cannot go beyond 1 i i can say this and if you are saying this i can say refraction not possible this is the beauty of snell's law so mathematically also it will tell you the physical aspect of the how the refraction will take place or not so what will happen this is the refractive index this is the refracting surface now 
this is our m2 air and this is m1 the light was inciding on 45 degree this is the 45 degree now it cannot refract and this is also practical if you go beyond some angle which is called critical angle what will happen the light will stop refracting it should refract practically if we see you can say it should refract but it will not refract it will bounce back just like reflection even this surface refracting surfaces are transparent what we will observe is the light will reflect so this is kind of reflection the light will not pass through it will not refract it will start reflecting and by the way this phenomena is a very famous phenomena which is called total internal reflection so every medium has it every medium has some angle and after that there will be no refraction r wala refraction nahi hoga now the light will be reflected back to the same medium and how we know sir because we can calculate now from the snell's law when this angle will be reached we had chosen 45 degree by randomly but actually if you see from for glass it is 41 degree after that you know you will get total internal reflection is this important yes is this important yes sir it is damn important so what we have learned is if you put at some angle more than critical angle may say this is glass and i put a light on a different angle some critical more than critical angle it will not go out this will not happen and the light will bounce back again if it is same same angle it will bounce back it will bounce back it will bounce back the light will travel inside the medium without any leakage it will not go out because the angle is more than critical angle and by the way what is this this is our fiber optics because we know that the speed of light is too much you know even 3 lakh 3 lakh kilometer per second that is in a vacuum in glass it is how much 3 divided by 1.5 2 lakh kilometer per second so if we can maintain that jaise unno maintain kar liye what will happen we should be able to transfer communicate our signals at light speed so that is why we say 100 gb fiber connection wifi what is this it is the same thing they are using the light to communicate they are using the light to communicate the signals of internet